Hello, my beautiful ladies. I wanted to hop on today and share with you um, a funny story that's inspired me to decide to expand the topics that I'm going to be providing here on my channel. And so um, historically, or at least, you know, the videos that I've been doing so far have been focused on new moms and helping them learn how to start a village so they can feel supported and empowered. So why am I expanding my topics um, and, and where am I expanding to? So I've decided to expand the topics to independent women as well and sharing my story and how I learned how to heal myself. And so super embarrassing, but so I had no intention of starting to go into this direction. Um, I was going to stick to moms and just focus on that and continue to create inspiring videos to encourage moms. Well, um, I ended up doing a video called My Rock Bottom Story. If you haven't seen it, check it out. I have a part one and part two. And so I decided that I was going, now first off, the fact that I decided to start to experiment with Instagram stories with my rock bottom story, I don't know what I was thinking. But I decided, you know, hey, on my Instagram channel, I'm going, I'm going to put some, some stories up. I haven't done that yet. Let me give it a try. So I put my rock bottom story up and a couple days pass. And then I get a message in Messenger and it says, oh, Carrie, thank you so much. I really appreciate you being so vulnerable. Um, the video that you put on Facebook was so raw and I just really appreciate you sharing at that level. And this is a woman that I've known for multiple years. Um, we haven't spoken in a while, but when I got the message, I was like, huh, that's interesting. I didn't post anything on Facebook. I posted my rock bottom story on Instagram, which I I don't have a lot of subscribers or anybody that I know specifically. And so I was racking my brain and like, okay, what, what, what video is she talking about? What's on Facebook? And if um, it's you, you know who I'm talking about. And I really do appreciate it. All of a sudden, I had just a sinking feeling in my stomach. I realized that I accidentally when I posted to Instagram stories, somehow I posted to Facebook stories. Guys, my Facebook has people from my MBA days. It has people from my network. This is my personal story that I thought, oh, I'll just post it on this Instagram account. You know, not many people are going to see it. And, um, you know, friends from high school, things like that. And I tell you, I could not move fast enough to get in and check in the Facebook stories. I've never posted to Facebook stories. I didn't even know how to do that. I don't even know how I did it. And I was just like, delete, delete, delete. I just, I could not move fast enough to delete that video. I was like, oh my gosh, it's out there. And so I ended up deleting it. And then I kind of sat with it and I read her message again and she was sharing the things that have come up for her and what she's been going through and just how much she appreciated me posting that video and how much she appreciated me sharing this idea of learning how to heal yourself. And it was the kindest message and then I ended up getting another message from another connection. Um, it was a friend of a friend and she messaged me as well and sharing her story and the things that she's going through. And she just really appreciated, again, me posting it and she felt like she was alone and was just very interested in learning how to heal 
herself and hearing my story and how I did it. And so fast forward today, because of all, of, because of this accidental post on my Facebook stories, um, I have decided that I am going to start sharing, um, sharing my journey here, um, sharing my journey here for independent women who have a desire and are seeking ways to learn how to heal themselves. So I'm so excited to be bringing this to you and stay tuned for more videos and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.